we can call Biden and we can call the Fed chairman. We can call, they're not going to listen to anyone. Yeah. So they're going to do the same old thing. They're just going to pump more of this fake money into the economy, hoping it stays inflated. Mm-hmm. But as Jim Record says, he says it's not M, it's not M two, it's not money supply, it's velocity. How fast is that money turning over? It's not turning over. People are saving it. Our savings mm-hmm. accounts are bigger than ever. Meanwhile, the balloon's coming down. Mm-hmm. So the question is, if there's inflation, will you get richer? And if there's deflation, will you get? Mm-hmm. So I'm planning it. You know, I'm not gay, but I swing both ways on this whole thing. I'm, I'm ready. <laughs> I, I'm ready for it. If it goes up, I'm going to get richer. If it goes down, I'm, so one of the reasons I like gold, silver, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and all that is because the Fed cannot mess with it. I don't mm. trust the Fed. And everybody says, don't fight the Fed. I'd rather be the Fed. I just yep. don't trust it. Mm-hmm. But I like the way they'll give money out. Mm. So the Treasury, which is Yellen and uh, Powell, the Fed guy, they give out so much money. I just go in there and borrow it. Mm-hmm. You know, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> and the interest rates are so low. Oh, my God. Yeah. The right trouble now. is it's going to make the poor poor. Yeah. Okay. That's what, that's what disturbed. Yeah. But you'll also see homelessness. And, mm. This was all. Security. Yeah. Thomas Jefferson warned about this. He says that if you have a central bank, which the Fed is a central bank, mm-hmm. you'll see homelessness. And, mm-hmm. Because the central bank or the Fed, which is the third one, is only designed to make the rich. Gotcha. So that's why guys like me make so much money is because the only way money comes into existence is I can walk up and borrow 30 million bucks. The average guy can't get a credit card. Yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? So the gap gets wider and wider and wider Yeah. because so many people went to school and they tried to get this job and then the taxes rip them to shreds and then they fire you if you don't take the jab for the COVID shot. Mm-hmm. You know, you don't wear a mask, they screw with you. Mm-hmm. So they just mess with you. So as a, a Marine Corps veteran, I came back and I said, nobody's ever going to do that to me again. Nobody. Mm-hmm. Well, I got taken down from Twitter, one of those guys, because I said, what I invest is gold, silver, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and bullets. <laughs> 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 and I'm, not, <laughs> I'm not kidding you. You think about it this way. Do you remember just a few months ago, you couldn't buy a bullet? And you, you know what? Uh, who was it? Uh, this character. You know, I, I, I'm going to shoot you. But first, I have to, I can't, I got to buy a bullet. I can't afford a bullet yet. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I'll say this. So I made, I made a fortune on bullets in this last, about six months ago. Mm. I bought a pallet of five, five, six, or, you know, what we carried in Vietnam, the two, two, three ammunition. Yes. I had a pallet of it. I bought it for seven cents a round and I sold it for a dollar twenty a round. It was really funny, you know, not too long ago. I go to the Shishi bar, you know, for all the yuppies, Arizona. And I'm carrying freaking ammunition in there to sell to Hey, <laughs> man, do, you gotta do what you got to do. My, dinner, right. my drinks and all this. <laughs> okay, number one, you want to, the reason you want gold, silver, Bitcoin, and bullets, you don't, you don't want to be part of the Fed or the Treasury. Hmm. You want to be outside this. And silver is my favorite for a couple of reasons. <clears throat> gold is for storing. Hmm. So I hold my, well, I have a lot of gold, but silver is for spending. Okay. Silver and bullets. So if the shit hits the fan and the dollar is all in pieces or it's all screwed up, people will always accept silver. Mm. So I can go and buy food. I can buy whatever you need to buy. So mm. I'll say it again. Gold is for storing, saving. Silver is spending. So I have thousands and thousands of gold, e- silver eagles and gold eagles. But if I have to run, I'm carrying the gold with me, but I'm going to spend the silver. Gotcha. Okay. Wow. Fantastic. Um, how much do you think someone should buy in, in gold as, as a beginner? Roughly. I, I don't really have that. You just start. You know, you find a gold dealer, someone mm-hmm. you can trust. Stay away from what they call numismatic. Just, okay. oh, this is a rare coin. How do you know if it's rare or not? <laughs> <laughs> like it's gold? I just yeah. got something that's, uh, the word is liquid. So it's, it's acceptable anywhere in the world, anytime. Gotcha. So I, I can take my silver to uh, Hong Kong. They'll take it immediately. Take my gold. And, and Robert... What does success mean to you? Huh? What does success mean to you? That's a good question. The, the, today, at my, I'm 74 years old. The happiest thing for me is when young guys like you tell me you. Mm. That's what it means. Okay. It, it makes me the happiest. Yeah, I saw I'm your happy. face light up whenever we mentioned about the book or someone commented about the book. You were like all ears. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, Because, you know, that's what my rich dad gave me. Mm. He gave me knowledge, gave me wisdom, and gave me spirit. 
he gave me the fuck you attitude. <laughs> so I, I, you know, I bought Bitcoin late. I bought it at 6,000. So today it's about 60. So I'm okay. So it's gotcha. always what was the price of entry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So if you're buying it today at 100,000, you might be late. Yeah. Same as real estate. No, it's no different. Yeah. It's not when you buy, it's when you sell. I mean, it's not when you sell, it's when you buy. So a lot of the times I, I need to be early. As so I was gotcha. early in Bitcoin and Ethereum. And I'm very happy. I like both of them. I think Ethereum's better than Bitcoin, mm -hmm. just because it's more practical, as far as I understand. Yeah. But I like silver because it's practical also. And, mm. and silver is 50% off its all-time high. Its all-time high was 50. Today is 25. Before we continue, help us clicking that YouTube like button and subscribe now to our channel. This shows the algorithm that you valued this information. And it helps us spread that message. Sharing is caring. And now, let's continue. Do you want to know one thing about crypto? I made over 3000% in profit in a few weeks. Fact is, the traditional financial system, the traditional money system makes you poor, not rich. If you want to earn 500,000, 1 million dollar, you have to wait until you're 50, 60, 70 in the traditional financial system and you probably will still be broke and you will be old. This is not a sexy combination as you can imagine. But the question is, how can you start in crypto and make these profits? Where to invest? Where to start? My name is Gunnar and I'm from Germany as you can hear and things are a little bit different in Germany. More about that later on. The fact is, there are lots of different cryptocurrencies. It's a gigantic universe where beginners and professionals get easily lost. But there is light at the end of the tunnel. There are seven key steps you need to follow to become successful in this market. You have to know them and if you fail one of them, it's literally impossible to succeed in this market. Just an example, one of the key points is your exchange and one of the biggest are for example Binance and Coinbase. These are trusted and well established exchanges but, and this is a big but, you won't find the super profitable coins on those exchanges. The unknown super profitable coins that get gigantic profits are not traded on those kind of exchanges. They are traded on much smaller insider platforms that are barely known. And I can tell you what those super secret exchanges are and why they are so profitable. And another super important thing are the right information sources. The point is, the internet is gigantic. There are hundreds and hundreds of YouTube channels, blogs, pages and much, much more. And there are also market makers and influencers. For example, Elon Musk, he is not a crypto guy, but the moment he recommended Dogecoin, it went through the roof, to the moon so to say. But why did he recommend it? Where did he hear it from? He didn't hear it from newspapers. And believe me, he is listening to someone. But you have to know who and you have to react before he is reacting. This is really, really important. And these are only two of the seven steps you have to follow in order to be successful in crypto. And if you want to know all of these steps in much more detail, and if you want to have a comprehensive checklist, here's what you should do. There is a link below this video. Click on this link and you will get the opportunity to subscribe to my channel. Click on the link and you will see a video where I explain the next steps. So see you soon. Click on the link now. I'll see you there.